Hey guys, I'm Miss Rosamond and welcome to my classroom website. So this is going to be the home page where you're going to first see when you click on the website. So it kind of has what it's going to be. So Miss Rosamond's first grade, it has the different tabs for different information that you can find. And then if you scroll down, it's going to be like a little welcome letter that's just going to kind of tell you what you're going to find and just a brief overview of the website. And then down here, you're going to have a link to my tech blog. So you're actually going to have, be able to see the posts that I've made. Um, here are two of them, and then you can see different links to different websites and articles that I found interesting on this right-hand side. Also down here, you can see that I have my email for them to click on it and immediately email me, and then when it was last revised. Next tab I have is Meet the Teacher. So this is the biography, kind of like the all about me, with picture and kind of where I grew up, where I went to school favorite things to do, stuff like that, just so they can get to know me a little bit more. On the resources page, we have kind of the resources that we collected as a class this summer um, for elementary grades one through five that either parents or students or even the teacher could go ahead and use inside and outside the classroom. For my choice page, I actually chose a class newsletter, which I thought was super fun. So I have a note from me and a little thank you. Um, this one was the monthly outside resources and practices, just like three things that they could do that month um, um, outside of school with their parents or with anybody really. Um, birthdays, upcoming school events, different reminders, a little student spotlight, an update on the class pet, and then any contact information if they needed to see me for any reason. So that would be updated, I guess, monthly. Under the Tech Projects tab, you have the digital story. And this is where the video of the digital story that I need for the history of LSU. So they could go ahead and see that project. You could also see the PLE and PLN section. So this first part is just a little paragraph of definitions explaining what a PLN and a PLE is. They each have a little graphic just to help with understanding. And then my chart which has the three different types of PLN and PLEs, the definition of them, examples of them, and then my reflection. So if you click on the reflection word, you actually get sent to my actual thoughts on the PLN and PLE. Lastly, in tech projects, we have the mobile app, and this is actually where I kind of evaluated um, Seesaw, the app. Um, so you could actually kind of go through and see kind of what I thought about it, its benefits, its challenges, and there was even a video tutorial. So parents could actually go on and see what I thought about the app, especially for using it in our classroom. Under the evaluations tab, we have the Apple Teacher Certification. So that just shows that I am certified as an Apple teacher and I have passed all of the badges needed for a Mac. And then lastly, we have the screencast, which is where I'm going to be posting this. But that's pretty much it. So thanks for joining with my website. Bye.